What's up, lifelong learners? This is your boy, Mr. Hang, and this is a tripod tutorial. Since 2006, I've been teaching high school kids how to transform their lives through education. So consider subscribing and join the mission to make the hood all good. Before we get into this video, I would actually want to caution you first, because if you pull too hard, you might do this, accidentally decapitate the tripod. Or you pull the legs too hard, and then this is what might happen. The legs will actually come out. Or if you don't pack it correctly, like the way I tell you to pack it, this thing is gonna fall out. This phone clamp right here could potentially fall out if you don't pack it correctly because a student accidentally had one fall out on her and she had to buy a replacement off of eBay for like two or three bucks. So be careful. That's all I'm asking you to do. All right, now let's get into learning about how to use this cheap basic tripod. So the first thing you're gonna notice here is you're gonna take out the tripod and you'll notice that the clamp comes out right away. The tripod is put in the opposite direction where the, the legs come out first, okay? And then the head comes out last. There's a reason why I pack it up that way, so it's easier. Now the next thing we're gonna have to do here is you're gonna learn how to adjust the legs. It's the easiest part. So you unclamp these, they come out, gently pull them out, do not pull them hard, because if you pull them hard, you're gonna break the legs. These are cheap, they're like really cheap, okay? So I'm gonna have you guys try that for a few seconds. So you've had a chance to try adjusting the legs. Now the next thing you're gonna try here is adjusting the neck. So there's this knob right here. Let me just, come on, you can focus. Oh, gotta love the autofocus. See that knob right there? It's like three, right? So you loosen it, and when you loosen it, you're able to pull out the center column. Again, be gentle, okay? Now you only need the center column when you have someone who's like super tall and the legs is not tall enough, so you have to pull out the center column like that. But be gentle, don't pull too hard because then you can pull this out as well. They're cheap, okay, don't pull too hard. Okay, so to be able to adjust the tilt, you have to loosen this part right here, the handle. Once you loosen the handle, you'll be able to do this thing called tilting, okay? So you can tilt up and down like this, and when you're happy with your tilt, you tighten this back up, spinning it towards the right, and then you're not, you're gonna have a hard time tilting. Again, be gentle, you can break these. The next thing is panning. You loosen this part right here. Okay, let me just get the close up here. All right. You loosen that guy right there, okay? So once you loosen that, then you're able to do this thing called panning left and right, okay? So tilting, if I loosen the, knot, the, the handle, tilting is for up and down or down to up. Panning is for left to right or right to left. And when you combine, when you loosen both of these, you're able to do more complex motions like this, tilting while panning. Now the next thing I wanna talk about is the top part right here. Let me push this back down. So this top part right here, okay, this part right here, notice that there's a straight part right here and there's a curved part right here. There's this, this section right, this clamp that tightened this down, you can take that out like that, see? And now all you gotta do is match the shape. When you put it back on, you, pull, you unclamp it and then you place it in and then you close it. Because if you put it in the wrong way, it's gonna be very, very weird. And uh, you're like that elementary school kid who's like trying to jam a star into a triangle, okay? So don't be that kid. All right, once you take it out, you'll be able to put on the clamp right here, the phone clamp. So you'll notice that you'll have uh, this thing right here is called a quarter inch. You see that, that silver part right there? That is called the quarter inch. This part, this black part right here is for camcorders to hold it in place. Now what you wanna do is you want to place 
the silver part with the gold part right there. See that gold part? Okay, and then you're gonna hold it like this. See that? Okay. All right, that's how you're gonna hold it. And then you're going to use this part right here to twist. That silver part right there, you're gonna twist. So you guys can spin it and put it on. You have a strong enough clamp, not too tight, just tight enough, okay, where you can't twist it anymore. And it looks a little something like this. You have this curved part right here, and you have that part right there. So then, once you have it like that, you are able to put it into this slot right here by pulling out this and putting the curved part with the curved part and the straight part with the straight part, like that, okay? So see how it fits in just like that, okay? Now you have your clamp on, how do you put the phone in? What you're gonna do here is you are going to not pull this uh, plume part, uh, like you know the quail plume right here, don't pull like that. What you're gonna do is you're gonna put the pressure down here onto this uh, clamp, and then you are going to, because you don't wanna just push up like this, you're gonna pull out everything. You wanna hold this down with your finger, and then you're going to put the phone at an angle like this, and then you push the clamp upward like that to fit the phone in there and now the clamp is going to pull the phone back down and then you'll be able to put the phone on just like that. So how do you take the phone out? Hold down this clamp again you don't want to push up okay and you don't want to pull this plume part. You want to hold this down with your finger you want to pull the phone up angle it out like this and then this clamp part will push the phone right back out once the the angle of the phone at a 45 coming downward like that. And then you take this apart, you basically disassemble it. All right, so now that this is disassembled, you're going to put this back in, like so, correctly. All right, make sure you line this up like that. You have the curved part with the curved part, straight part with the straight part, and then you adjust your tilt and pan until the handle goes in nicely like this, okay? And then you put the head in first. After you put the head in first, then you put the clamp in second, and then you zip it up like so to hold everything in place, like that. Because if you don't have it like this, what's gonna happen here is the phone clamp is going to come out, and we don't want that. So that's it. That is a quick tutorial of how you work with these tripods and disassemble it and reassemble it.